This is Shane with thatsitguys.com. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Sapphire Radian 6950 and later on an unlocking 6950. Packaged a video card with the anti static bag and the anti static foam inside the cardboard. And here's the actual video card. I like how they don't actually hide anything. You get your video card right away. Okay, once you remove the tray, then they give you a mini display port to display port adapter, an HDMI cable, and two Molex a six pin adapters as well as a Crossfire bridge and a purple DVI to VGA adapter. Alright, we'll be putting the 6950 in the Cooler Master Half-X tower. Okay, we're just going to do a basic install guide in case somebody hasn't done this before or they're uncomfortable with this, but obviously you want to make sure the length is going to not be blocked by the other parts of the tower, but you just line it up with the actual PCI Express slot and then just slide it in. And that's it. And then take your. Now, I use thumb screws for the Cooler Master half X, but you just screw in the screws and you're good to go. Obviously, you have to plug in the power ports, but as far as locking the card in, it's the easiest way. Make sure you always start with the bottom screw because it's actually locked in. The top one slides up. And then we already had the power cords already set up, so. We're just going to plug them right in. And that's it. Just plug in your video cables and you're set. HDMI for my monitor and VGA for that little side monitor I decided to use. All right, now we're going to be doing the unlocking portion of the video. All you have to do is navigate to the link that's in the description bar below and you will be taken to our website where you can find all the information that you could need and here's the link to Tech Power Ups flashing tools the actual full guide is available on their website but we're lazy so we're just going to click this link will take you to their website and it will allow you to download the file kit that you will need which any of these websites will work save it any place that makes sense I already have a copy saved. And then extract it. I already have it extracted. I think you can figure that part out. And open up the Flash to 6970 batch file. To open this up, it prompts onto the screen. Press any key to continue. You press any key. And it flashes the BIOS. And there you go. and then it should direct you to restart the computer. And after it's restarted, you want to open up GPU-Z, which they've included in the package. And all you want to do is verify that you have 1536 shaders, and you'll also notice that they overclocked the card to be equivalent to the 6970. And lastly, we're going to be doing a giveaway of the Sapphire VaporX 4870 one gig model. And all you have to do is check out the forums for more information or on our website, and we'll also give some more information down below. Mr. Tambourine Man. Hey.